Good morning, you guys. It is currently 10.34, and let's get ready for a shopping adventure. I am so excited. But first, we need to do something about this bed because it looks like she slept pretty good last night, you guys. Okay, guys, my bed is now all made, so now let's put on an outfit, do some makeup, and then we're ready to go. You guys, I'm literally so excited. I haven't been shopping in so long. See, we haven't gone shopping yet because, like, a little pipe exploded in our house. But I'm still gonna get ready because I like getting ready. Oh, that's not cute. Okay. Let me redo that. That's not cute. Wait, actually. Okay, never mind. It's not bad. Okay, let's get ready. Okay, guys, now I'm gonna do some makeup. I just absolutely love doing my makeup. It doesn't really matter if we're going out still. But I just really love doing my makeup. And then for mirror, I'm just gonna be using this Natasha Denona palette. Because again, I still do not have a big mirror. I really, really need one though. Um, and while I do my makeup, let's talk about a little bit. I just kind of like wanted to give a little update on how my 2024 is going. My 2024 so far has not been amazing. Um, I feel like even just in the month of January, it's just been kind of sad, honestly. I've been feeling like I've just been growing up so fast and not like thoroughly enjoying it, which is not like my favorite thing ever. Because I want to be enjoying my youth and stuff. And But I feel like a lot of the time I'm just kind of holed up in my room, which is kind of sad. And I really want to get out of that. Next, we're going to be going in with the Olenken Skin. I don't know how to pronounce it, you guys. Um, Peptide Strength Boosting Trainer Moisturizer. I really wanted this year to be about self-love and self-care. Um, but just in the month of January, I'm finding that it's way more difficult to really care for myself the way that I want to be. Just I haven't been putting in the effort. And I really need to be more motivated and strong, I guess, in that sense, to really put myself in the position to be motivated and to take care of myself in the ways that I want to be taking care of myself. Okay, guys, next I'm going to be going in with the LYS Secure Skin Gripping Primer. If you guys have any advice or anything, I would love for you guys to leave it in the comments. I feel like I've been trying to do unrealistic things and set unrealistic goals for myself. I need to be thinking more short term and still of course have my long term goals in sight, but um, I think short term goals would definitely be a little bit more helpful right now. Okay guys, so um, now we're gonna be moving on. Um, I'm not gonna be doing concealer today just because I did a little bit of like self fake tan. I used the B Tan um, gel. You guys have probably seen it on TikTok. I got it off TikTok shop because it was on sale number one and number two it got really good reviews some people were saying that it was bad um i actually love it i think it gave me a very very beautiful glowy tan also how i did it was i kind of put on lotion before and then i did the tan um i turned out really well it was a little bit bad and like splotchy on my hands and my knees and my elbows um but i just genuinely think that's because i didn't work it in well enough Anyways, next um, I'm going to be going in with this Rare Beauty Bronzer stick. It is in the shade Power Boost. I love this so much. I got it for Christmas. Um, it is so amazing. And I don't know if it's exactly my color, but I love to put it on my cheekbones. I put it under my jaw a little bit. I like to put it on my nose. And yeah, that's about where I like to put it. And then I just blend it out with this very crusty beauty blender going to sephora today if we still go to the mall um i usually wet it but right now i am too lazy to wet it so um, i'm just gonna spray this glow recipe spray on <laughs> why do i say it like that the watermelon glow ultra fine setting mist or toning mist i think is what it is and i just blended the skin now we're looking very bronze and glowy and so now we are just going to go in with the if I can find it. Found <laughs> it. Okay. Um, the Rare Beauty blush in the shade Hope. I love this blush. It's very beautiful. My nose. And sometimes I'll put it on my chin and my forehead, which might be a little weird. I don't put very much when I do that. 
Um, but it just gives it like a very rosy glow. And we're just gonna do the same thing, just blend it in on top of the bronzer. Now the blush is pretty much all blended in. It looks so beautiful as of now. Mm -hmm. Um, now we're just going to be going in with the Rare Beauty. Beauty is Fenty Beauty. It's the Fenty Beauty setting powder in the shade Butter. I love the setting powder so much. It's so great. Oh, that was a lot. And I spilt it all over my desk. This little brush. I don't know where it's from. I think I got it in like an Ipsy box or like a something like that. Um, like a couple years ago. Um, I don't have good brushes really though. I just kind of use whatever I had. Maybe I should get new ones. Today while I'm at the mall, I plan on going to Free People, Airy, Sephora, um, Urban Outfitters, and I think Bath and Body Works, and I think that's it. Those are my favorite stores. I love those stores so much, you guys. Comment down below your guys' favorite stores and what stores you think I should try because I'm trying to branch out a little bit more with like where I'm shopping at recommend any small businesses or anything in dallas that you guys um really enjoy because i would love to go support okay you guys now the powder is all on and so now we are going to go in with our powder blush and our liquid highlighter i know you're not really supposed to put liquids on top of powders but i'm not even going to talk about the stage of my nars orgasm powder blush it is actually falling apart and in two pieces, but it is my holy grail. I love it so much. And I just apply it with this like dense, I'm pretty sure this is like a foundation brush. I don't think you're supposed to apply blush with it, but this is the most beautiful shade of blush. I love it so much. It is well loved definitely and in two pieces like you guys saw. Next, we're gonna be going in with the Rare Beauty Highlighter in the shade Enlighten. This is my favorite one. It looks so good on like paler skin like I have. Um, it's just so illuminatingly beautiful. And that was a lot. I did not even mean to put that much on my nose, you guys. Oh my gosh. Okay, you guys, now that we are done with the base, we are going to move on to eyes. So for eyes, I will normally just do spoolie, eyelash curling, and then my favorite mascara of all time, the Lash Princess volumizing mascara this ancient eyelash curler that is very gross and i'm just gonna curl my lashes until they're curled to my liking i guess <laughs> my lashes are now curled so now we're just gonna spoolie them a little bit just to make sure they're really up there and then we're gonna put on our mascara and then i also like to spoolie them afterwards just to get out any clumps and then this is controversial, I think, but I also do curl my eyelashes after the mascara is on just because I want them to be, like, lifted and high, so. <laughs> Alright, you guys, the makeup is now done. So now let's go pick out an outfit. And these wild wow, table jeans and then this tank top and matching cardigan from the brand A New Day. Um, all three of these items are from Target. I love them so much. It's a really cute outfit. So now let's just get changed. We did some damage you guys okay so we actually ended up going way way later because the plumber didn't actually end up coming until around like 4 30 so we ended up leaving the house at 5 which was i didn't think we were even gonna make it to the mall before they were gonna close i'm just still so grateful and happy that we got to go i absolutely love shopping while we were there i stopped at bath and body works lululemon airy free people and sephora um but i only got things from free people sephora and airy what i'm gonna show you guys is from sephora so from sephora um they were actually out of a lot of stuff but i got a refill of my glow screen this is the super goop broad spectrum sunscreen i love this stuff so much guys this is the summer fridays 
lip butter balm i oh my gosh i tested it it was so amazing it's so buttery soft and amazing on the lips and this is the beige vanilla one it smells so good you guys here it is you guys i love the like jelly like bendable tip that it has that way you can kind of like apply it later It's just so great. So the next thing I got is the 71 Sol de Janeiro spray. This is by far the best one. Like out of all of them, the 62 is really good. And then the 78 is really good or 68. I don't remember what it's called. I think it's 68, but um, the 71 smells so, so good. It smells like, it's like macadamia nuts, I think. It's just, it smells amazing. Um, I got this Glossier Lash Slick. This is one of my favorite mascaras. Um, if you're going more high-end, I really do love it. And it's just such cute Manila's packaging. Like, it's just so cute. The next store that we stopped at was Airy. I love Airy. Um, while I was in Airy, I felt so bad because we went in so late. The workers were already like folding and like putting away all the clothes. I felt so bad. So I was just trying to like, get in and out of there without like touching anything. I felt so bad for them. I look so tired. My heart goes out to all of you guys working in customer service. It is not easy. This is from Aerie. I got these adorable offline shorts in this beautiful green color. I got these same shorts in this beautiful lilac purple periwinkle color. I just, oh my gosh, I just love bright fun colors like that. Next, they were having 50% off sale on um, these sweaters, so I went ahead and picked up this beautiful white one. It's such a great basic, and it will look so good with those shorts. And then, lastly, I got this adorable tank top. Um, I think, believe these tank tops were actually 30% off. They had this, like, teal one that I wanted to kind of match my shorts, but they didn't have it in my size. But it's okay, because I got this adorable striped one. I just love it so much. Oh, and then I also got these earrings and they were so good. The last store I went to was Free People and I definitely got the most from Free People. Free People is my absolute favorite store. I just love it so much. I love the vibes of the store. I love the workers. Like, it's just all so amazing. I love the Free People movement ran the most, but just regular Free People on its own is amazing. I will say it is so expensive, but all the clothes are amazing quality all the time and they last for like ever. All right guys, the first thing I got from Free People was this adorable, like buttery soft top with the back that's um, cut out. I just love this top so much. It's great for layering and I just, I cannot get over the texture. It's like a bodysuit texture kind of, but it's not a bodysuit, it's just like a top and I just love it so much. The next thing I got was actually the same top, but I got it in black. Again, as like a layering top and just kind of like a cute tight top to wear with jeans or like sweatpants or just something cute and basic like that. And then again, it has the adorable open back, which I love so much. The next thing I got from the Free People Movement line was these adorable shorts that look like a skirt. You guys have probably seen these on like your TikTok for you page or something. But yeah, I got them in this amazing hot pink color. I love them so much. Next, I got these same shorts again. If I buy something or if I like something, I'll just get it in another color. I got them in the black color just to kind of go with more outfits. They're so cute. Then next, this is my favorite thing I got. It is this amazing onesie. I'm not sure what this one's called. Let's see. I'm not sure what this one's called, but it's like shorts and it's like a giant t-shirt. It is just so cute and it's in this amazing like blue color. It is just so cute, I love it so much. And then lastly from Free People, you guys, I wanted this jacket like a few months ago, but I think at the time it was still full price. But um, I went into the sales section today. It was only $19.95. Oh my goodness, it's so cute. I love it so much. It's just the most amazing texture and look how soft it is. And it's the, it's the color I wanted too. It's this like beautiful mauvey pink. I just love it so much, you guys. That was the end of my haul. I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Um, I'm going to try to link everything I can in the affiliate links below. 
and I just I just love shopping I'm so glad I still got to go today even though all that stuff happened in the beginning of the day if you guys made it this far in the video tell me what your favorite store is in the mall to shop at I love you all so much have a great night bye